I'm Jennifer Gardner from Worcester State University. Hello, I'm Trampika Soisa, also from Worcester State University. And our research looked at self-esteem, social capital, popularity, and um, need for accessibility as predictors of technology addiction. So we looked at two different types of technology addiction, both communication and entertainment. So communication would be anything that brings you in touch with others. Um, we looked at social networking, texting, and phoning. And then entertainment would be anything that you're usually doing alone. So MP3 player listening, internet surfing, and um, virtual world gaming. So what we found was that self-esteem was always negatively uh, predictive of technology addiction. So that if you had high self-esteem, then you used any of these types of technology, phoning, texting, internet surfing, less often. And similarly then, or at least conversely, popularity was positively associated with texting, social networking, uh, and even uh, phoning. The curious difference was in the use of social capital, so that if people were trying to do maintaining, which is maintaining pre-existing relationships, then they engaged in the things that actually involved other people, like the communication tasks. But it was not really, um, or it was positively associated with that, but negatively associated with things they did by themselves, like internet surfing. Uh, on the other hand, bridging, which is where you make new relationships, was certainly positively related to social networking and even internet surfing, because people are looking to make new relationships. And those who had strong relationships, like bonding, actually that was negatively associated with use of technology, because they did not seem to do that online. So that was the conclusion. So really, in this day and age, when we consider the amount of technology use, it's sort of curious that it's not all positive, and there are some positive aspects in terms of popularity, but it's curious when you look at the self-esteem component that it really is negatively associated with technology usage.